Hey guys, in this video I will talk about what pellets I feed my guinea pigs. Unfortunately the first half of the video didn't record, um, luckily halfway through I had made a summary and this is where the video is going to start in a few seconds. Also I had to put the bag with the pellets next to the cage, which meant that the guinea pigs started destroying it, um, which was very distracting. Um, and very very cute. I'm very gutted that I lost that footage, but there are still a few funny moments that I managed to record So I will share that in a separate video called outtakes So even though this didn't go according to plan I hope um, the video is still informative and that you will still like it and As always if you have any questions, please let me know uh, and I will try and address them So hope you enjoy the rest so I get Birch's, I'm sorry if I don't pronounce that right, Super Guinea XL. Um, I've used that since I started uh, with guinea pigs back in 2005. I've never ever regretted it. I get the 10 kilo bag um, and unfortunately that's the biggest size you get. I could really do with a larger bag but that's what you get. Um, I know there are different kinds. Um, I get the mint flavored one. Um, I know there's uh, oregano and I don't know some kind of current. I don't know what it's called. I can't remember just now. But um, and I don't think they do that in the 10 kilo bag. Although I may be wrong. But I just stick with the mint because that's what they like. That's what I know. That's what I trust. Um, maybe I'll try the other one at some point in the future again. <laughs> Fix you crack me up tonight. Um, <laughs> but really, yeah, so that's what I like to use for the pigs. The pigs, as you have seen, really, really like it. I feed the pigs one bowl a day. Um, although I would say about that, that the bowls I use are larger than the ones um, you usually get for guinea pigs. This bowl over here is a lot larger than your normal size bowl that you get for guinea pigs in a pet shop, I find. I can't remember where I bought this, but I know I have another one of the same size that says dog on it, and I got that in Tiki Max. And then over here you can see a, a smaller bowl, um, so that I would maybe put um, in the cupboard in the hall, which is one of the free ranging areas for the piggies, and just top it up maybe once a week. It's just more for fun than anything else. So, where do I store my pellets? Um, so I store my pellets in one of these boxes and I'm afraid I can't tell you where I got this from. I had it for, for a long time so I will only um, put one bag of pellets in this and usually I buy more than one bag of pellets but I only open one at a time so it keeps fresh for as long as possible and I will decant one um, bag into here and then I've got a little scoop that you just can about see in the bottom and I use that to scoop it out. So where do I buy my pellets? Usually I buy them off the internet uh, from a company called Feedem um, and a 10 kilo bag there is $17.99. Now that's the cheapest I've ever found a bag of Super Guinea XL. Um, the only downside is that you have to buy three bags to qualify for sh free shipping. But that's what I usually do because it is cheaper than I can find it anywhere else. However, this month um, we don't really need to stare at that box any longer, do we? Let's look at the guinea pigs while I talk. However, this month um, I'm buying a few other things for guinea pigs. I just uh, placed an order for a bag of just grass and three bags of easy bed. Um, I would also like to buy them another couple of piggy pots, so it all adds up. So this month I really wanted to place a small order on pellets for them. So um, when I shopped about I found the bag that I got today at Pet Supermarket and there it was £18.77. Now I believe that is a discounted price by, so it's discounted by 10%. I don't know how long this is going to last or what the usual price is but it's £18.77 at the moment. Um, and it's free shipping. So that's where I got it from today. And I do have to say, Willow, I'm saying something. You should listen, not destroy the bag. Hmm? 
I do want to say that I think um, pet supermarket the delivery was shorter than from Feed'em. Um, I could be wrong, um, but it felt a lot shorter. I only placed the order recently and it arrived really, really fast. So that's good. Um, but then again, you know, Feed'em is my usual place where I go and the price is really, really great if you don't mind buying uh, you know, according to their minimum quantity to qualify for free shipping. So this is what the pellets look like. Nothing too special, I don't think. Um, what I do find though, is that the pigs always seem to be digging for their favorite piece. And I really don't understand that because on them, it's my impression that they all just the same. So why they go digging for their favorite is really beyond me, but they eat everything. So it's not like they leave bits behind, but there seem to be always that one special bite that is right at the bottom of the bowl and they have to kick all the rest out to get to it. So you may have that issue. There seem to be a golden nugget somewhere whenever you put it in the bowl. So one last thing before um, I leave you tonight is that um, when I get the pellets delivered, they usually are in a cardboard box. Now, if you have guinea pigs, uh, you may know that cardboard boxes are great. It, it's just something that makes you happy when you have guinea pigs. Let me show you what I mean. I got a bag of pellets and a free house for the guinea pigs. So, you know, this is not going to last the way a plastic house or wooden house would last. But it's great fun for the piggies to destroy it and it's great fun for me to watch them do it. And we will all have good fun with this for a couple of days before it goes into the bin. So don't just throw the box out straight away. Get the piggies to play with it. Um, if you have a camera, record it and put it on YouTube so we can all see it. While this video didn't go according to plan, I hope um, it was still informative and you liked it. Um, if you have any questions about anything else of feeding piggies or anything about this particular this particular uh, brand of pellets, let me know. Um, I think these are UK only, or it's a UK based company, so I'm not sure if they are available anywhere else. But um, if you're in the UK, I can, I can really recommend these pellets. Anyway, I'll let you watch the piggies while um, I start cutting their veggies. And uh, thanks again for watching and see you next time. Goodbye!